What's up guys, if you are sick and tired of getting scammed by NBA 2K's packs, make sure to head over to safembamt.com, use code BUGS for 5% off a checkout, and get that cheap, fast, reliable MT that you guys definitely need in this game. What's good YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K21 My Team video, and guys, today, we are going over the market as per usual. Before we do get into this video, guys, if you guys please smash that like button, drop the sub, comment down below. You guys will qualify for another MT giveaway that we are running today on stream at around 2 p.m. Eastern time, grinding for the man Opal Blake. Um, but yeah, we're going to go into this video. We're going to talk about the market, see if it's crashed, see if it's rising. We're going to go into it as much depth as possible. Um, if you guys do need MT, I am selling and buying MT. I have a lot of stock on Xbox and PS4. If you do need, make sure to hit me up. I am buying and selling MT. But yo, we're going to get into this video, man. The support has been crazy. We're going to do a nice little giveaway all today on stream. Uh, probably 250k or 225k winners because the support has been absolutely amazing. And I got to show love to the GOATs who actually have been subscribing. So... I'm going to get into this, man. I'm going to go over one of the best cards I think that are, are worth investing once again. And it's Tommy G, man. He's back. The investments of Tommy G are back. And look at this, man. He's back down to 3200 So what you guys should be doing, man, right now, if you guys could get for the price I'm getting, I'm saying 3200 or lower. Maybe even you could push it to 3400 or lower. That's probably going to be your best bet. To automatically make MT. So even if he doesn't go up, you get him for 3300 you sell him for 4K at let's say 50. So you're gonna make out 500. No, no, I'm saying so if you sell him for 4,000, you get him for like 32. All right, so 4,000, which would be about 400 MT profit minimum. Okay, that's at worst. That's if he barely rises. So you're talking about 400 MT times let's say 100, that's 40K times 5, uh, 50, which is 500, uh, 50K. So if you do the math, it's it's pretty good to me. I think that's right way. No, it would be 600k because I mean 60k, and then it would actually be 30k profit if you do get him for 3200, sell him for four, and that's at minimum. I think he's gonna go up to 7500, like he did the other day, and I ended up selling around 30, made about 4k per even after the reduction. It was crazy, man. I made a lot of MT that way, and I hopefully he goes up in value once again. So now, guys, the festival is over. We should see a little bit of a market rise. And guys, today, there is a challenge for Mike Connolly, a.k.a. Mike Connolly. But if you do this, guys, we're going to make a lot of MT today. Uh, Mike Connolly, man, another place you should snipe. I just sniped that one out for 7,400, sold for 93. Made about 1,000 MT clean, which is pretty solid to me in one second. So definitely try out the gold Mike Connolly filter. Uh, he's riding around 9,500. Probably snipe him out for like 7K or something. And it'll sell instantly because a lot of people are doing that challenge. Grinding at Opal Wade. I'm going to get my level up to at least 26 today. That's the plan. Do the Ascension board on stream. But, yo, we got a lot of stuff to go over. Let's check out the Shooting Guard Pink Diamond Filter. Let's see what Lamo... Uh, not Lamelo. Let's see what Mono Ginobili's at. Let's see what Luca's at. Um, I did end up selling my Luca yesterday for 96k because I got him for 76. So, if you do the math, man, I'm going to make around 11,000 MT clean off the Luka Doncic. And um, I honestly think he's going to go over bid because there's not that many left. The market's actually up a lot. Looking at Mono Ginobili, he was around 60, 58K the other day. And it uh, looks like he's up to 80-something K. So, guys, today might be a day to sell. Let's keep checking out the small forwards, the pink diamonds, and all that good stuff. Another car, guys. Guys, the market is rising big time. Like, today is a great day, man. John Havlicek, there's only four or five up on the market for... Quick sell value, which is absolutely, or not quick sell value, uh, a little over 70 something K, and then it goes to 88K. So, guys, the market is up big time. We were waiting for this moment. Giant investments. All the investments are going to pay off. Uh, let's look at contracts, man. Contract diamonds, I got a bunch for 15K. Also invested in range extender and whatnot. So, let's people look at contracts for the diamond end. And there's one for 17K there. I say contracts go up to 22 ish K. Uh, for 17,100, that might be a good steal right there. Um, honestly, I'm going to pick that up because why not? 17,100 for a diamond contract is most definitely worth the value. Uh, there's just so many good investments right now. Uh, another one, Deep Threes, aka Range Extender on Next Gen. It is called Deep Threes. Um, invested in a couple of these bad boys because I know they're going to go up in value. So, uh, honestly, gold range for 15,000 is like low, high key a snag because 
If you think about it, man, as they release more free cards, these D3s will 110% go up in value. Um, so honestly, I'm going to buy gold D3s for 15900 I don't think that's a bad idea whatsoever. And um, I invested in the bronze D3s for around 15000 MT. It's up to 20 k I think it's going to rise even more now. We got to go over diamond shoes. There's so many good investments that if you guys made, you're going to make a lot of MT. Now, we're going to go over diamond shoes. Why? Because honestly... They're going to go up in value, man. Diamond shoes are really big in the community. As you guys can see, they're actually up a little bit, man. Uh, diamond shoes. So I got most of my diamond shoes for 3,500 MC and over. And they're already at 4,000. Not that much profit made yet. But my predictions are they're going to go up a lot more. And as you guys can see, the diamond shoe market is going up in value. Um, I'm going to show you some what I invested in this week. Um, I'm going to show you my whole collection. So here we go. I invested in Pete Maravich. I think he'll go up. Halishek. A bunch of Tommy G's. I did sell a lot of my investments, I think, Saturday. Um, these Ruby cards aren't really the investments you guys want to see, but I have a lot of my outcomes. I got Haslam's, a couple Haslam's, not really a lot. Kawhi's, a bunch of Tommy G's, probably around 20. Uh, a diamond contract, D3's right there I just invested in. Uh, we also have a bunch of shoes in my collection, so if you guys want to invest, if you guys get them for the right price, I pretty much show you the pricing in here. Um, but here are some of the shoes I invested in, and not only that, now, since I invested in those shoes, I can actually use the enabled filter. So if you go to Nike, you go to enabled. Uh, let's see what I have to buy that's cheap. Because uh, mostly I bought all the OP shoes right there. The KD13 hype is pretty dirt cheap. Uh, I think we already bought one of those Nikes. So looking at this, man, the prices will rise, man. You just got to know what to pick up. If you see a Nike three-point shoe for the low, it's an absolute snipe. You're going to make lots of MT. Uh, diamond shoes, man. You really gotta think about the stats. Like, if you think about it, Nike's probably the best one you're gonna want to snag. You just gotta look at what's good. Like, if it has steel, if it has three-point shots, defensive. You know what I'm saying? So, if it gives you a mid-range three-point shot, die, uh, steel, block, whatever, those are probably gonna go up in value. Like the KD13 height for the diamond shoes are the ones you want to pay attention to. I don't have my hands on those right now, but I'm definitely gonna try to get one on. If he's like, if I can find a KD13 height or a Kobe shoe. For the low, I'm most definitely going to snag it because those are the, definitely the most rare shoes right now. So that Kobe right there, 16,000 MT, that might be a decent snag right there. 16,000 MT is definitely not the worst, but um, I feel like we could get it a little bit cheaper. Not totally sure, but yo, let's keep going, man. We're going to go over the market a little bit more. Um, Diamond Mellow is definitely a car that I feel like might be the worth the pickup, but let's see. Uh, the Derek Coleman, man. I popped that token pack. I was one of the first players in the world to put up the diamond cards. So, did the pack, put them up, sold each one. Derek Coleman, DeMar DeRozan, and the other diamond, uh, Tony Parker, for 18000 each. I don't understand why anybody would buy them when they're going for 10 k but I sold all of them. And I, got, I spent 40 tokens to make around 50000 MT clean, which is an absolute W. And we did just get Maurice Lucas pink diamond. So, we're out here grinding, man. Diamond Shibus filter is kind of ruined. I doubt anybody would put up a cheap diamond at this point, man. Diamond filter is absolutely good. Just destroyed. And I'm going to show you the Mike Connolly filter right here because I actually went on it for one refresh and got a 1000 MT snipe, which is insane. So this filter right here, there's probably a million gold Mike Connollys out there. And right now, man, if you have some Mike Connolly stocked up, that's why I'm keeping up all these rubies, these golds, these emeralds, because they're all good stock, man. Trust me when I say this. They're going to go up in value big time. Trust me, trust me, trust me. It's definitely worth stacking your gold, your silvers, anything, guys. Sapphires, rubies. When I say that, man, it's definitely going one. Now, one more person I want to look at is probably Nick Anderson because he is a ruby that I actually versed on next gen that absolutely destroys me every time I verse him. And honestly, I say 1400 or lower for Nick Anderson. If you get him for 1400 right? All right, so you say you get 100 at 1400 which is 140K, okay? So 100 at 1400 he goes up to 2200 You make 2,000 MT clean. Or no, you make 600 MT clean. 600 times 100 is 60K clean off 140K. So if you think about it, what is that? Like tripling your profit almost? It's like, oh, it's like doubling or tripling your profit, which is insane. And uh, for 140K to make 60K, that is some easy cash while also sniping at the same time. So if you think about it, I think you could invest in anything, even though a lot of the high tier cards are rising like crazy. But uh, yeah, that's all we got for the video. If you have any market talk questions, let me know. We got a, um, a giant stream later, probably an hour and a half to two hours. And yo, that's all we got. Hope you guys did enjoy. Let me know anything. If you need MT, hit me up. Have a good one. Peace.
What's up, guys? If you want cheap, fast, reliable MT, make sure to hit me up on Instagram and Twitter. I am buying and selling MT. Hit me up right now.